I'm done in your own, it's just on Chimo. Yeah, but these are my battery voltages. And I picked up a IMAX B6 um, smart charger. I'm discharging down to 2 volts. Man, this thing looks like it's going to be forever. And I got a bunch of sales to do. So, I got to figure out a way to discharge these batteries safely. And, how can I say, um, efficiently. So, I'm about to um, work out something to bring these batteries down a little bit lower. So that I can get to that, that cutoff and then bring the whole pack up as one. Alright, so I got the headway cells here linked up in series to add my voltage up to, you know, car battery voltage, base head voltage. Uh, when I first plugged it in, it read like high, like 13.7, 13.6. Right now I'm under low and I'm showing. Sorry about the shakiness. 12.7. I got it wired up to this little black and decker power inverter and then wired up to a fan and as you can see it is definitely blowing I guess while I'm at it showing how I'm discharging I might as well show y'all uh, my bus bar configurations here basically I'm doing a um, series parallel it's gonna be 4 in series and 5 in parallel so uh, uh, a 4 a four s 5p pack and these are my bars this one right here is gonna be the top connecting plate this one right here is gonna be my bottom connecting plates link it all together and then these two right here are going to be my positive and negative I still got to cut this one down to make it exactly eight inches each piece is pretty spot on as you can see it's pretty even now I just got to cut this one down and make it even and then drill the holes one here one here I'm gonna do two spots on the positive and negative for um, studs to stick up through so that I can mount my uh, my bus bars or mount my uh, my ring terminals on two. These two plates right here are pretty much perfect. I kind of messed up with the drill bit here, but again, I got a countersink, so these would be okay. They're a quarter inch by two and a half. These are three quarter by one inch, and it's um. I'll let y'all see. It's T60, 61, 65, 11, aluminum, which is pretty good for bus bars and if you're making an airplane. I don't advise making an airplane; you might crash it. But yeah, so we'll see how this works out. Blame me. Blame me. You niggas know my pyroclastic flow. You niggas know my pyroclastic flow, flow, flow. You niggas know my pyroclastic flow. It's R A W, R A W. You looking at the Grand Wizard?